Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new, my name is Sasha and for today's video, we're going to be talking about Ipsy October 2021 Glam Back Spoilers. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's, it's going to be October like next month already. It's, all, it's already September. My birthday month. So before we get into it, if you guys are interested in unboxings, like my unboxings, and then some makeup videos here and there, I try to do them once in a while when I have the time. And some of these spoiler videos that I always do every month, then go ahead and subscribe to my channel. I do love talking about these spoilers with you guys because I get to like share my thoughts about every item or what I think about that month. Spoilers. And later in the future, I do want to do box of charm spoilers, but that's like way, way, way later in the future. Maybe next year. I dress for the occasion because it's gonna be spooky season and like the bags oh my gosh ah, the bags <laughs> it's so cute it's so cute it might be a little bit kiddish for some people but I think for me especially the glam bag design I really really like the bag design they're kind of like spooky kind of gothic a little bit and kind of punky too it's like a mixture of everything I don't know I'm not sure what kind of material it is but you guys could tell by the way how it looks it has that texture to it and the lips oh my gosh black lips with vampire tea and then with the hint of green it looks like the zipper it's a lime green color by the looks of it so hopefully inside it should be green if it's not green inside then bam that's really surprising that's not it better not be black it better have that pop of green all right so that's a glam bag design and if you guys are interested how the glam bag plus design looks like it's pretty much the same thing but i think the material is going to be more like cloth like material might be a little bit on the soft side by the looks of it so these spoilers well compared to the glam bag plus spoilers which i'm going to have in a separate video the glam bag spoilers are a lot better than the glam bag plus also i forgot to mention so starting in october they sent an email to supposedly everyone and i received one of those emails too and the price is going to go up for both glam bag and glam bag plus so the glam bag is now going to be 13 dollars per month i know i was debating if i was going to cancel my glam bag subscription i think i might just because of the price change because yeah i need to cut down on my spending like somehow because we have something planned for next year so i gotta save money for that before that it was ten dollars so it was ten dollars twelve dollars and now it's gonna be 13 so i don't know what's up with that hopefully it gets better overall by these spoilers it kind of looks somewhat better somewhat there are a few repeat products but we just got to give it a few months and see how it goes so for the glam bag plus the price is, is going to go up to 28 dollars and then we're still going to get those drawstring bags before we get into the spoilers the choice date for glam bag is on the 21st and now it goes live at 6 a.m pacific standard time the first spoiler up is by huey detox shampoo so it's actually a little shampoo little shampoo mini and way their products is usually like i got their leave-in conditioner which is very perfumey but knowing that, I think the shampoo is probably going to be highly like scented or perfumey. So it says this clarifying shampoo uses one of our favorite fall ingredients, apple cider vinegar. Ooh, that's, yeah, that's really good to cleanse, to cleanse your scalp, to cleanse away dirt, excess oil, and product buildup, and keratin that strengthen hair for less breakage. So that sounds really good. If you're like looking into trying out this shampoo, then why not? Wow, we don't really get to see like shampoos that often in Glamour's whole just noticed that spoiler okay. so the next one up is another hair product and it's by Brio Joe hair care and it's a curl charisma rice amino and avocado leave-in defining cream so this is for curly hair and Brio Joe is a really really good really good hair brand and so recently i just tried their their hair treatment mask the one that you use in the shower and oh my gosh it makes such a difference to my hair like okay so all these minis that i have it's really helping because i have like multiple of those i'm like okay i want to keep using this so i don't have to buy a full size because usually i buy my full size nature lab tokyo the hair mask usually i buy that but the price went up on ulta so i'm like oh so i gotta go through my minis first this is a curl defining cream so it's supposed to make your hair like more curly and more bouncy it's also supposed to help nourish your hair and it has rice amino acids to seal off the hair cuticle and prevent frizz and avocado oil to soften and hydrate and and Kania extract to the vine. If you get a chance, if you haven't tried Biojo, then you should give it a shot because it's a really good brand. And the products, it smells really good. Like it smells how a hair product should smell. Like it's not so perfumed. It's just the right amount of 
goodness scent. The next border is by another Murad product. Yes, Murad. And it's a Retinol Youth Renewal Night Cream. This potent night cream uses a gentle time release form of retinol and helps smooth, hydrate, and plump without irritating your skin. Saturday on the night and wake up to a youthful glow. So when it comes to retinol products, like any retinol products, you're only supposed to use it during the night because retinol causes your skin to be very sensitive to the sun. So that's why I only use it during the night. But retinol really does like such a difference to your skin like ever since i started using retinol oh my gosh like i used to have like smile lines like they're not as defined anymore and by using retinol and even right here my like my small crow's feet or whatever like when i used to be very rough on my eyes and i used to wear just eyeliner back in high school and then the way i took it off i would be so rough with my eyes and i'm like Ugh, that's why i stopped and yeah ever since i started using retinol it really helped out with some of my fine lines no matter what age it's never too early to start using a retinol product so the earlier you start, then the younger you look later on. Next spoiler up is by Pacifica Beauty Glimmer Shimmer and Highlight and Blush and Firelit and Glimmer Shimmer. So this looks very familiar, but I think it's a different one though. So because it has a highlight and it's a blush. And that blush actually looks very peachy, very coral, nice, right? And that highlight looks like a champagne golden shade i haven't looked at swatches yet but i do have a pacifica product the one i have is a bronzer and blush so i just brought this out so i could show you guys the formula it's very pigmented so you really have to start out with a little and you could just build it up one i have so this is a blush and bronzer and the thing about these oh my gosh these are like almost considered as full size practically like in a glam mat that's so great and another thing it has a mirror in the back of this so when you have your brush, you could just turn it around and then use the mirror. So it's so cool. So you could take this like on the go, like you don't even need a compact mirror. And it's very, very soft. I, I haven't used this in a while. So the highlights probably gonna have that soft feel to it too. Or the powderiness. So right here, it's some swatches. Pretty pigmented, look at that. Pretty pigmented. This water up is like a repeat product, I guess because i think this is the third time i've seen it this year i do have the mini one but i don't know where it's at so i do have a full size that i got from boxycharm so this is a tarte big eagle mascara in black so this is a full size guys i did use this mascara on my eyes earlier and yeah i didn't have time to record a clip but that's how it looks it's really pretty okay, so it kind of flakes a little bit depending how hot it is but yeah but this is how the brush looks and the, with the mini size, oh, the mini one is so tiny. So sometimes with the mini mascaras, it's really hard to handle sometimes. Or sometimes, depending on the person. The like spoiler is a really, really good one. It is a repeat product. I think the last time we've seen this was probably maybe a few months ago. And the time before that was another time last year. It's the Tasha the Dewy Skin Cream. So I need to try this out because I really, really enjoyed the water cream. So I have the water cream right here. And this is how the size of the mini is. So it's like this. So it's not going to be this one, but it's going to be like the water cream. Like I just barely pan out on it actually last night. So this is my second one I ever received. And I like the smell of it. It smells like roses. It's very light. And the formula of this, it really sinks into my skin like very good. Like you only need a little bit. I'm wondering if the dewy one is like the same consistency. I hope it is. And also that one's probably gonna be more like give you more of a dewy look. Well, this one doesn't give you a dewy look. Try the dewy cream. Let me know how how you like it. Does it smell the same way as the water cream? Like, let me know. Next spoiler up is by the Yuma Batter Boom Ao Natural Volumizing Mascara. So Yuma, oh, I really wanna try. I wouldn't mind trying out this mascara because you guys, one of my favorite mascaras is actually by Yuma. Do this one. Let me see how this one, the difference. This one has like an hourglass. This one has a similar shape actually. So I'm not sure what are the difference between this one and that one. But if you guys get a chance, try out this mascara whenever you do. I think I recommend this mascara some other time too. Alright, anyways, next spoiler up is by the Skylar Fall Cashmere Fragrance. This one got notes of toasted almond, caramelized vanilla, and ginger just like a warm spice chai. Oh my gosh! I love chai. I love chai tea. I love chai latte. Oh my gosh, I need this. So the next spoiler up is by the Balm Cosmetics and Celeste Bold Highlighter. So the Balm, their formula is really good. I have no complaints about that formula. But yeah, that's a very yellowish highlighter. So it's probably going to be a little bit too dark on me. So I, I suggest maybe on the um, 
more tan complexions would look better you could also use it on your eyes too like the highlighters work just fine on your eyelids now for the next spoiler the last spoiler is it's by theory so it's a charcoal bamboo detoxifying body scrub so i think theory is kind of like an indie brand hmm so it says this cooling body scrub delivers instant relief to dry itchy skin and helps detox pores using charcoal and pumice to reveal a brighter fresher looking complexion bonus it has a refreshing citrus, citrus scent that's so invigorating on sleeping mornings Ooh, that's awesome so it'll like wake you up like if you use this like in the morning like it probably smells really good i wonder so those are all the glam Back spoilers and overall there's a few repeat products just a few well from what i noticed it's a tatcha and a tart but i have no complaint about the tatcha i want that tatcha but the Murat product looks really good and the brujo if it's your hair type then yes the way just keep in mind that it might be very like highly perfumey the skyler fragrance oh, smells so it sounds like it'll smell so good that's about it so i hope you guys like this video if you guys do make sure to give this video a thumbs up leave a comment down below what you guys think about these spoilers like which one you're hoping to be in your bag i'm not sure like from these spoilers these are just spoilers but i don't know which ones are going to be available as choice but we'll see on the 21st on glam bag choice day also if you really enjoyed this video and want to watch my unboxing videos and more then Go ahead, subscribe, and hit the notification bell and all buttons so you guys can be notified every time I upload a brand new video. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.